Hello YouTube fans, Facebook friends. Here we are, another Gardening with Vincenzo video. And I'm out here today looking at the strawberries at the base of the uh, dwarf apple tire uh, that was pruned and witnessed in my other vi videos. And I just wanted to point out, and I'm going to do a slow pan here. What you see on the left are my dwarf sweet williams. I can't wait till they start blooming here. That'll be a very nice show of color along that uh, 40 foot long uh, container garden. That's my trellis garden. I have a lot of cucumbers put up on there. But I just wanted to show you the benefits of the pruning because you can see all the apple blossoms here. These will all be apples. And I actually saw some pollinators out here today and I was quite pleased to see those. And if you prune the tree for an open center on an apple tree you can see the benefits you get much more blooms you'll get larger apples I still have the bags on my graphs from a previous video looks like a couple of them have taken already I can tell and I thought I'd just share that with you as I'm slowly walking along the side here, trying not to trip, <laughs> holding my camera here so I can actually walk around it. And you can see that there are quite a few blooms, blossoms on this. I was very pleased to see that. Well, I thought I'd share that one there. It's definitely worth the effort to uh, prune the uh, fruit trees. You know, keep them healthy. You need those pollinators, though. You know, without the bees, you don't get any fruit. And those strawberries are blossoming also. All right, this is another quick video, Gardening with Vincenzo. All right, be safe out there.